All right, uh, morning everybody. We are showing this this video. Sorry, I'm tired. This video will be showing a kind of full day of what it's like essentially to be me and the start of my day. Now you can see right now it is 509. We're gonna do a, about six mile run with Loki and then we're hitting the weights right afterwards. See you guys soon. Morning, I start with about 24 ounces of water and I add a uh, liquid IV patch to it. Um, helps with hydration and one of these kind of makes this thing like three bottles of water. So it's the first thing I take whenever it comes to, you know, working out in the morning. Oh, we're gonna down this thing. It's not easy first thing in the morning. There we go. All done. All right, time to go for the run. You ready to play? You ready? Yeah, he's ready. All right. See you guys in the road. We're on mile like four, four and a half. Feeling really good. Um, legs are just a little sore, a little sore from that leg workout yesterday. But I'm feeling good. Loki's feeling good. We're killing it. Right, buddy? Yeah, we're gonna go after this. Go and lift weights. Uh, a lot of volume building. Keep going. Let's go, come on, buddy. Let's go. We're almost home. Let's go. Let's go. Good boy. Good boy. Come on. Let's go. Almost home. Now it's uh, 6.30. We just finished the six mile run. And uh, now we're gonna go lift. Uh, today's gonna be a kind of high volume day. Um, you know, we did heavy legs yesterday. So I kind of ease into Friday and Saturday. There'll be no lifting tomorrow, but today will be, you know, volume, um, upper body. Try and get like 10 sets of 10 in, you know, chest press lap pull downs and do some arms but uh feeling good this is typically what i do every friday i get my run in and then after the run i get my lift in so i can just enjoy you know friday hanging out with uh dogs and uh the fiance you know discipline does equal freedom so when you get this stuff done early you have your whole day ahead of you and also don't laugh at my outfit this is uh, my running attire my Captain America running attire, my uh, hat I got from Amazon. Really cheap. Best running hat I ever wore. This collects all the sweat, but uh, let's hit some weights, finish this workout. Of course, we're the only person here. Early in the morning, no one's here. I the whole place to myself. Um, kind of minimalist equipment. We got dumbbells, go up to 45. We have some exercise balls, medicine balls, treadmills, and then we got the kind of combination rack. Lap pull down, chest press, and like leg machines. So we're just, you know, making the most of what we have right now. Like I said, today is a more of an easy day. 10 sets of 10. Try to get 10 sets of 10 lap pull down, 10 sets of 10 chest press, some biceps and tricep work. Let's get it started.
workout part two is done. Felt good. Got a lot of volume in. Now, this, like I said, it's typically how Friday works. So now that I finished the strength part of my workout, now how I continue my day is since I ran with the puppy, now I gotta walk the older dog. So that's the next part. And then after that, that's when I get ready and go to work. So sometimes I get a, I, I get a lot of stuff done in the morning. I like having stuff done in the morning because it gives me more time in the afternoon and evening. So next thing I do is walk the big dog. All right, now we're walking the uh, big dog. It's typically like my cool down part of the workout. Um, try to get a mile in in the morning with him and two miles at night so he gets his miles in as well. But um, yeah, this is typically how the mornings work. Then after we walk him, feed the dogs, and then next, I take my ass to work. Um, so, feel really good, honestly. This is a great start to Friday. I feel really strong. The run was really fast. Um, you know, sometimes running with the dog, the miles are semi slower, because he's stopping and like, you know, peeing, but Today we were still doing like eight 20 minute, eight 30 minute miles with him stopping. So we made a, made a lot of time up. And even at lifts of 10 sets of 10 felt great. Everything's moving easy. Um, despite doing heavy chest, you know, beginning of this week, the chest press machine wasn't that bad. So it's good. Like I said, so now that the workout and the physical intense stuff is over, we do, we gotta do the everyday, normal day American stuff. We gotta work and then uh, enjoy some family time. So I'll see you guys when I'm on my way to work. So now we are on our way to work. Um, usually we always leave around typically 8.30, 8.20. Uh, it takes around 10 minutes to get there, but um, this is kind of the easier part of the day. Work's honestly the easier part of the day. It's a little more relaxing. Um, the fact that I got the running and the lifting done, it's starting a day off with a win. So whenever I do usually start my days off with these wins, it makes the rest of the day and the work day so much easier. So right now we're driving to the office, we'll get our uh, eight hours in, we'll come back, and since it's Friday, we're gonna enjoy a nice uh, little dinner. Uh, tonight we're gonna make, we're gonna try to make, um, make pizza. Uh, using a cast iron skillet, so that's kind of the goal today. But right now, we're on the way to work. Just you know, get these eight hours in. I'll give you like a mid update when it comes, you know, to lunch because typically I fast until 12, 1 o'clock every day, and around 11:30, that's when kind of gets to me. You know, after running and lifting and you know not eating, kind of eats up at me. But uh, like I said, we fast till about 12, 1 o'clock. Then every then we eat lunch and usually no matter what I have it tastes good around that time. So I'll see you guys. I'm in the office right now. It's like twelve seventeen. Um, we're just now eating lunch. We got a nice chicken, uh, broccoli, and steak um, kind of bowl going. Usually, typically with my lunch, I kind of keep it high protein, rice and broccoli. Typically what I have during the week and I'm kind of sweating right now because I added some of this uh, chili sauce to it. it. Makes it a little more spice, but I like spicy food. But uh, this is typically lunch. Like I said, fast till like 12 o'clock every day. I'm actually, this is my office. It's really nice. I have my own office to myself. It's awesome. Can't complain about it whatsoever. I can eat whatever I want. It can smell bad and no one cares. But um, typically, excuse me, that's what happens you know, during lunchtime. But um. But yeah, fast till 12 o'clock, then four or five more hours of work, and then we uh, hit home, and we'll make dinner, and we're trying to experiment with dinner tonight with a cast iron um, oven baked pizza, so I'm really excited about that. It's kind of cheat day, but um, that's typically the work day. I might grab a snack after this, typically a protein bar, but uh, usually during the week, two meals a day. And then Friday and Saturday, kind of like my cheat days where I kind of enjoy it. So uh, I'm going to go finish this lunch. Favorite part of my day. It is uh, Friday and it's 5 o'clock and I'm on my way home now. Um, now, after, you know, a long day of work, uh, working out, 
running, running with the dogs, walking the dogs. I'm not gonna lie, I'm a little tired right now, so I'm gonna enjoy some rest and my meal. We're either doing, hopefully, we're making that pizza today, or who knows, we might change it up and get Chinese, we'll see. But this is one of the best parts of my day, especially on Friday when we head home. Um, you know, being in shape and working, it is hard sometimes because it's like a lot of your day. Like I've been up since five o'clock already and it's five o'clock now. So it's like 12 hours and you're constantly getting stuff done. But like I said before, it's nice getting stuff done ahead of time. It makes things a lot easier. When things are done ahead of time, I can like go home and enjoy the rest, the start of my weekend. So that's whatever I mean whenever I say, or to quote, Jocko Willick, discipline does equal freedom because the fact that I was disciplined and got everything I needed done now, I have the freedom to enjoy the rest of my weekend. I have the freedom to enjoy a drink. I have the freedom to enjoy pizza or whatever I want to eat today because I had a very strict diet during this week. Um, so that's great. We're, we're coming home now. Probably got to take out the dogs, but then I'll see you guys for dinner. Me being lazy, instead of uh, actually making the pizza, we got... Chinese food. I'm pretty excited to eat this. It's a uh, place we call it. Tokyo hibachi and uh, sushi. Really fucking good. So uh, tonight, since I tonight's my cheat meal, General Tso's chicken. But that's typically this will be dinner. Um, since it's Friday, will I have dessert? Uh, maybe. Who knows? Uh, like to enjoy myself during the weekend. Um, so typically Friday and Saturday. But um. After this, we go and uh, eat dinner, watch TV, still like election talk. But, uh, watch TV, watch a good movie, and then feed the dogs afterwards. I'll see you guys whenever I'm taking the dogs out. Now, it's about 9 o'clock, and it is one of the best parts of my night. The walk, my favorite, my second favorite. Well, they're equally my favorite. Four-legged animal for a cool down. So that's pretty much the day. That's a typical Friday. Friday's a little different because the workouts, the strength training's done in the morning, so I can just rest. But um, other than that, that's pretty much a day. It's a little exhausting, also fun. But um, that's pretty much how a typical day in my life goes. Wake up early, get after in the morning, go to work, eat a pre-made lunch, that half the time tastes good because I put a lot of seasoning in it and half the time it tastes like shit because I burn it. But um, that's a typical day and it's good. Honestly, I'm happy. And I would do definitely more in a day of a life videos what my day's actually like. But um, I'm just gonna walk Duke for right now. Enjoy the rest of this night. Maybe have a beer or two and go to bed and get up early tomorrow and go run but until the next time see you guys soon like i said thanks for watching the videos if you like this videos please subscribe hit the like button um i'll talk to you guys soon